Have you ever been on your phone late at night and your eyes are absolutely getting blasted by your phone's brightness even though it's all the way down at zero? Well, the S22 Ultra has a feature called Extra Dim. Go to your settings and go to accessibility, then tap on visibility enhancement and scroll down a little bit so you see Extra Dim. Turn this feature on and what does this feature actually mean? It basically means that your phone's display is going to be pushed to be dimmer than dim. This basically means that if you reduce your screen's display brightness all the way down to zero, you can go even lower than that. I find this feature really cool because it's like a low hack that barely anyone knows about so now you can go back to your friends about this feature and tell them that Tech with Tech is a genius. Some people don't know this but S22 Ultra is not even running at 100% of its power. Samsung limits the processing power of the S22 Ultra right outside the box and to be fair it's quite reasonable. If they gave you the full power and capabilities of the Snapdragon 8 Gen 1 or the Exynos 2200 then your battery life will be rock bottom but there's a way around this and it's going to enable you to tap into the full potential of your s22 ultra it's a bit similar to when naruto befriended the nine-tailed fox shout out to my anime fans out there so you go to your settings and tap on battery and device care scroll down to see more battery settings tap on it and tap on processing speed it'll be automatically set to optimize but you can bump it up to high and if you really really need all the juice your s22 ultra has to offer and you want to go full ballistic mode then you can pull you can pull all the way to maximum however it's not all plain sailing there will be consequences in doing this. Your phone will get noticeably hotter and your battery life will drain faster than it usually does but hey, with great power comes great responsibility. Copy and paste will go down as one of the greatest inventions of all time, everyone under the dog loves copy and paste. But Samsung has made that beloved feature so much more convenient to do. You can now copy and paste text that you see on images and this is partly thanks to the artificial intelligence we get on our new smartphones nowadays. I don't even need to look at my script for this one because I use it so often so you go to your gallery and tap on the photo you would like to copy and paste from then once you see the text you have to long press on the text and voila it's literally like copy and pasting from a word document you highlight it gets highlighted and just click copy and paste it somewhere else it happens so quickly and it's so accurate as well it saved me so much time at university because you know when you have to take a photo of the lecture slide and then you're like oh i have to get back home write it all down this that you can just copy and paste it from the photo. Now this next feature is exactly what Samsung is the leader when it comes to having a stylus on your phone. They're constantly improving and perfecting the stylus on their phone which is something that most companies rarely ever do. I'm not going to keep rambling on so let me just show you. So basically if you have a note in your Samsung Notes app and that note contains an email address, a phone number or a calculation, by just hovering your S Pen over those three different things you get an icon pop up on the right. And from that icon you can do things such as emailing that email address directly, calling that phone number directly or calculating that calculation. When I found out about this feature I was also mind blown at how crazy the artificial intelligence on our phones are getting. First we have the predicted writing on our phones that came with the S22 Ultra where the AI will predict where you're going to write before you even write it. This way Samsung managed to get the S Pen's latency down all the way to 2.8 milliseconds and now we have this. Samsung's doing extremely well in bringing us features that we actually care about and that are actually usable compared to the history of them chucking a lot of features at the wall and seeing what one sticks. I've made countless of other videos talking about the crazy features on One UI 5 so watch this video here to not miss out on what your S22 Ultra is capable of. Like and subscribe if you haven't already. Follow me on Twitter, it's going to be the second link in the description and I'll catch you in the next one.